I've never been to Arizona personally, but I think it should be a lot of fun. And just just really excited to get get it going again one last time for this year. And, uh, let's ready to have some fun. You had two humps, kind of like Penn State, otherwise a real good season. What would it mean to finish off, culminate, and put something on on top of your cherry for the for the holiday season? Um, it always means a lot to win. So I mean. Just not let this game get too big in our heads or anything like that. Just come out here and play like any other game. I mean, obviously, it's a ball game, so it should be a lot of fun, a little hype behind it, but it's just another game. It's just football. When you guys are clicking on offense, what are you doing right? Doing everything right. I don't, I don't just O-line's hitting on all cylinders. Receivers are doing their thing. Jake's doing his thing. Running backs are doing their thing. So, I mean, it's just one of those types of things where everybody's clicking and just getting it, getting it. Moving the ball forward, that's how it's about. One part of your team that is important is, is the special teams with the punt return. How important is he to the program? Very important. He does all the things. He pump returns, catches the ball very well, he blocks, uh, he does everything. So, I mean, Dante is, is he's a great player. So, I mean, he, he, he's amazing. But it just, it, you never notice how much he really does because, I mean, everybody's like wild about the punts and everything, but blocking. And he'll set up other routes by uh, everybody having all their eyes on him and just throwing underneath routes to other guys. So, so let's make that. Happen. Last question: We cover Penn State. We've been covering all the, even their game when they lost out in Columbus. Well, what, what do you see from their defense? Obviously, that's what you got to go against. So, what, what do you see from their defense? They don't put too much pressure on the quarterback, but it seems like the back seven is pretty solid. Yeah, um, but those guys don't have any weak spots. Uh, most teams kind of have like a kind of drop off point. Maybe it's their linebackers or DBs or something like that. But uh, everybody's really solid on that team. There's only good guys on that uh, on those guys. So I mean, it's just one of those things where it's uh, it's gonna be it's gonna come down to details and just making a play. So there's not there's, you're not gonna get a break. You're not gonna get one of those guys a uh, receiver running wide open or a huge hole or something like that. You just you gotta play them straight up. All right, thanks for your time.